Let me tell you something about family. Girl! See, I don't understand this, right? We come from the same mama, same daddy. We come from the same DNA. We come from the same place of residence. We went to the same school. We might have different friends, man, but we slept on the same bunk bed. Why is you in competition with me, man? You supposed to help me. You supposed to love me. We on the same team. Why is it when I'm struggling, man, you will laugh at me. You will go talk about me. You will think bad things about me. You will secretly say yes. Yes, this motherfucker struggling when I'm your brother. We on the same team, same last name on the back of our jersey. But you will run and help a stranger. You will run and help put a stranger in position and they the real up. They your opposite of your blood, your DNA. I'm your blood. Y'all got to stop that. See, I got a problem with family, man, that got the same DNA as me, but you in a competition with me. Matter of fact, the competition is in secret because I don't even know I'm in the competition, but you still losing. I got a problem with family when they don't act like family and we supposed to go sit around these family functions knowing that we dysfunctional. I got a problem with that. We got to start addressing problems with family. Do you ever think to yourself that God put us in this family together? We couldn't pick that this going to be my brother, this going to be my sister. Yeah, let's go down there and get in our daddy balls and our mama coochie. We, we, we couldn't pick that. Since God put us in this family together where we didn't know each other from sperm cells, we was made to help each other. We was made to survive with each other. We was made to make it through the struggle with each other. We was made, man, to break generational curses. God said, you know what? I'm going to put him with her and they're going to be brothers and sisters and together they're going to break a generational curse that they mom and daddy fucked up. That's what our job is. Blood make you related, but loyalty make you family, man. See, family just ain't family no more. They just as fake as friends. They just as fake as them snakes and them goddamn streets. They ain't no different, man. Y'all got to stop putting family in these position where, man, then my brother, man, he won't do me like that. Then my sister, she won't do me like that. Then my cousin, then my goddamn mama, then my daddy, he won't do me like that. He'll do you like that. Cause your daddy ain't nothing but a goddamn donor and your mama ain't nothing but a carrier. That's just a title. Family will see you struggling. Family will see you going through a tough time. You losing your house, losing your car. Got no food in your refrigerator for your kids, which is their nieces and their nephews. And you know what they'll do? They'll laugh at you. And they might have the resources to help you, but you know what they'll do? They'll go help a total stranger, the opposite, the person that ain't got their DNA. they rather help a total stranger before they help the people they call family. And we got the same last name. When I need somebody to lean on, I should be going to people in the street when I got a brother. I should be going to females in the street that's my play play fake sister when I got a real sister. I shouldn't be going to niggas in the street to look for advice and guidance when I got an uncle or a daddy still alive or a mama still alive, man. Let me tell you something, man. Family got to start acting like family because what's going to happen is, man, we're going to be forced to come together at a funeral and cry together because we don't know how to love on each other. We don't know how to take care of each other. We don't know how to look out for each other. We started looking down, and the only time you're supposed to look down when you put your hand down to help a man up, but y'all so quick to help a stranger up. Y'all don't want to see family up. Man, listen, man. Family got to stop being crabs in the bucket. When one crab get to the top, the other ones put them down. And they all look the same. We all got the same DNA. The same blood flowing around in our brain. We got to use it though. Yeah, we got to use it and understand that we was built to come together and help each other. I cannot be in the competition with my family. Especially when you my family. The last three letters in the word family is I-L-Y. And them let us stand for I love you. Learn how to love family, man, because you never know when your mama going to go. You never know when your brother going to go, your sister going to go, and half of y'all be waiting on that call because y'all feel like, I don't f*** with him anyway. I don't mess with her anyway. I don't care if she die. Let me tell you something. If your mama die, your daddy die, man, you going to cry because that's when real life starts. If your brother die and that's your only brother, you going to cry because you knew you could have fixed that and half of the shit that y'all got going on is really some petty shit. Let that shit go, man. 
leave it with God. Let God fix it, man. But at the end of the day, y'all can talk it out. And if they don't want to talk it out, at least you try. Try to work things out, man. Because I'm going to tell you something right now. These niggas in the streets, they ain't your family. They'll switch on you, turn on you, and turn bitch on you at any motherfucking time, man. If it's involving coochie, money, or jail time, these niggas in the street don't care about you. They'll kill you and blow you out your mind. But your family, man, they're going to always have a compassionate heart for you. They're going to always have empathy for you. They always gonna have sympathy for you. They always gonna feel for you because they understand that I seen him in the room next to mine. I seen her go through things, man. That's my sister of mine. I seen him go through pain. That's my brother, man. He went to prison. He lost things. He, he, he went through it to get to it. So I love him. But the niggas in the street, they don't love nobody but they self. Stop treating strangers better than you treat your motherfucking family, dog. Because one day, all you gonna have is your family. And if you don't cross everybody in the family because you right here in competition, you ain't gonna have nobody to call on, and it's a cold, cold world out here. Please don't let me show you how cold my heart could get. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to my channel, youtube.com slash Brown 305 We the business.